Do you know an AI tool, a free and intelligent chatbot similar to ChatGPT right in your browser, Microsoft Edge? You do not hear wrong. It's called Bing AI. Let's walk with me through this video to learn how to start using Bing AI without paying any fee and how to combine it with Active Presenter to create an interactive quiz. Open your Microsoft Edge browser, search for Bing, or in the sidebar at the right. Add and pin the site to the bar to use many times later. Going forward to the sign up and sign in part, if you do not have a Microsoft account yet, create it with an email, a password, then fill in your information, go through some verification steps, and you're done. If you already have a Microsoft account, then log in with your mail and password. Choose chat to start your conversation with Bing AI. By default, Bing AI allows you to choose a conversation style and theme with three options. More creative if you want an imaginative chat, more balanced for an informative and friendly chat, more precise for a concise and straightforward chat. In the previous video, I have guided you how to create a CSV file, Google Sheet, and import it to Active Presenter to automatically insert questions. And in today's video, I will guide you another way for you to do that. Create a GIFT format file and import it to Active Presenter. GIFT or GIFT, General Import Format Template, allows you to use a text editor to write questions in a simple format that can be imported to a computer-based quiz. With Bing, it is easier than ever for you to do that. If you already have the content, just ask Bing to convert the file to GIFT type for you. If you want to build in the full questions from the very beginning, interact and ask Bing as many detailed questions as possible so that the chatbot can understand your request deeply. Now the content is done. Go to a folder where you want to save the gift file. Right-click, New, then Text Document. Rename the file if you want. Then copy the content in the gift format that Bing has designed for you earlier. Paste the questions here and press Ctrl S to save. Next, open Active Presenter. At the question type, choose from file. Then, choose the GIF file you've created. Done! All the questions have been imported successfully. The final stage is to customize the quiz layout as you want. You can go to the tutorial about ChatGPT and Active Presenter or other detailed tutorials about customizing themes, events and actions, or Slide Master at the top right corner of the screen. Once done, preview and export your project to see the result. So that's all for today's video. It's time you created your own content now. Don't hesitate to sign in to Bing of Microsoft Edge and download Active Presenter for free in the description box below. See you soon!